Hi, in today's video, I would like to talk about the ambient AI, which is the AI technology that can listen to the conversation between you and the patient and then create notes automatically. I have been using this technology for a couple months now, thanks to my employer allow me to become one of the people that try and use it. So this is still in the early development and that's why I cannot really tell you the name of the app yet. I can show you the app and how it actually works. It's not allowed for me to do so but I can share with you my experience, what are the good things about it, more importantly, what are the bad things or the downsides of using this technology. So let's get started. I would like to describe with you how it works. It's very simple. So in my phone, there is an app and then using that app, I just have to click record, right? I have to ask the patient for consent if it's okay to have our conversation recorded during the encounter. The patient said yes, then I'll just press record put the phone where the phone can listen to both of us. I usually put in the middle between me and the patient. Once the conversations are all done, I just need to click one button, which is create notes, and it will create the notes automatically. It will create the history, some physical exam, if you mention it, and then the assessment and plan. I would say it's pretty amazing. I thought it would be like a mess or not a clear notes, but no, the notes are actually pretty accurate. The grammars are perfect. It's just amazing. Now let's talk about the the great things about this app well of course the first thing is that it saves time you don't have to type you don't have to dictate you just have to copy paste yes you still need to check because even though it's pretty accurate it can make some small mistake that you have to delete and change but these are very very minimal so it takes less time for you rather than you type or you dictate especially if you're a slow typer so that's the main advantage save time secondly is the quality of the notes sometimes that's a minute you don't have high good quality notes with the perfect grammar every time but with the ai there won't be a problem the grammar will be perfect every time it would be very clear it won't be a vague notes there won't be any weird misunderstanding about the notes so the quality of the notes is actually higher and will be always consistent when you use it and the third advantage the less effort well i did mention about less effort but i want to explain it this way in the outpatient for example because i've been using it for outpatients you see maybe 13 14 some people see 16 patients a day now there are some providers that like to see the patients and then after that write the notes later and this is actually very very painful i personally don't do that because you have to recall 16 patients and write it down later you will miss a lot of stuff i personally write the notes right after the encounter is finished and i'm a fast typer so i only need less than five minutes to complete my notes but sometimes an encounter lasts too long like 30 minutes or maybe a little bit more 40 minutes if it's a long visit where it's a complex case so if that happened i have to move to the next one without actually completing my notes and then sometimes that can happen three four times in a row once i got time i have to complete the notes and i have to recall four patients in a row and that's still quite painful with the ambient ai that won't be a problem anymore because it's recorded it's safe i mean you just have to copy paste it it's really effortless you get less tired at the end of the day compared to not using the ai this extra energy can be used to deliver higher quality care for the patient or for me answering some of the messages in basket so i have more energy to do that rather than focusing my energy on writing the notes and recall the notes for some of the providers that actually don't finish their notes right away after the encounter this becomes super super helpful it will save a lot of time so those are the benefits of the ambient ai now i'm going to talk about the downsides the first two downsides is more like technical which i think can be improved upon the third one is something that i don't think can change and i just realized this after a couple of months using it so let's get started the first one is the application for some reason the one that i'm using at least requires me to log in again and again so in order for me to log in i have to put my phone number and then it will send me a text to my phone number security codes and then i put the codes back it's pretty annoying it will take about maybe a minute to do that to get into the website like every single time website and then i need to solve the puzzle blocks you know clicking on which one is bridges which one is the bikes you know it's gonna take about a minute and you might say well it only takes about a minute it still save your time right well not really for me personally because i'm a fast typer before i use the ai ambient technology i used to type in front of the patient as the patient speak and then i'm gonna put the recommendation and i type as i put the recommendation for the patients and i put in the 
wrap up so the patient have it in the after visit summary and I just need to copy paste it into my notes so once the patient's left if the patient is not complicated has no medical concerns just a follow-up then I could finish the notes less than a minute that less than a minute is a note now I have to wait the extra minute I would already finish my notes before I actually get into the portal where I can grab the notes from the AI a lot of people will not be a problem but for me it's an issue it's, it's a waste of time but I think it can be improved in the future if I can stay locked in then it will be very very fast so that becomes the reason of why I start to use the AI ambience a little bit less and less if I see the patient is not complicated I wouldn't bother because it takes time for me to lock in I'll just finish my notes within less than one minute and it will be done now the next downside is the accuracy I know I told you that the accuracy is very high but it's actually inversely proportioned with the length of the encounter so I found that if your encounter with the patients is 10 minutes or less then I would say it can have about 90-95% of accuracy. Some mistakes here and there which you can correct no problem. Sometimes it's just a perfect note. So that if it's the encounter is less than 10 minutes. If you have a conversation I found that if it's 20 minutes or even 30 minutes but basically the longer you have conversation with the patient the less accurate it becomes. If your conversation is about 20 minutes probably it's going to be about 80% accuracy and if it's like 30 minutes I think it goes down to like 70-75 accuracy so it loses a lot of of details in the summary of the notes that they created so that is the issue which I think can be addressed in the future I think the AI technology will get better and better eventually you will not lose the details even though the conversation is longer now we move on to the last one this last one I just noticed it actually a couple days ago after I used it for a couple months so here is the downside that I don't think can be changed because I've been using it for a couple months the patients that I saw back in around March or so was able to see them better as a follow-up I mean two three months later and one thing that I noticed and I'm quite surprised about this is that I recall less about the patients yes the notes are nice the notes are great but because I didn't put effort to write down the notes I don't really remember the patients again the notes are nice but there is some form of a visual memory here if I put my own notes because I have to think when I put my own notes and that makes me remember about the patients more now if I don't contribute a lot on those notes I recall less about that patient so I just realized that would be actually quite a big downside because I would like to remember what happened before now it's hard for me to actually recall exactly what happened yes there is in the notes but it doesn't feel like yours it doesn't have your personal touch anymore because 90% are created by the AI it's the same thing like if you use ChatGPT to write 90% of your personal statement that it doesn't sound like you so it's similar to this one if everyone used this all the notes will sound the same there's no clear who actually make the notes is it Dr. Haryadi or is it Dr. Smith or who was it you know it's all the same and you won't be able to see that personal touch so I think that's a big downside it's a choice if you use an AI this is what's gonna happen really you put less thought of course you will recall less about the patient maybe we can solve it by putting your own probably three four short sentences about the patient you want to put a little bit of effort as well so you can kind of recall the patients I don't see this a big problem let's say if the ambient technology is being used in inpatient because uh, rarely you see them again or I mean if you see them again then it would be either quite short notice or you already forgot them anyway you read the notes you won't actually remember the patients because it's been too long so I don't think it's a, a problem with inpatient and also I, I don't think it would be a problem for other people to read your notes because it's more understandable actually because it's more grammatically correct and less vague it's more I think really quite specific problem for somebody like me who works in outpatient and see the patient over and over again I would like to have some memory and remember about the patients now it becomes less and becomes vague don't even remember actually kind of like seeing the patient because I put really less effort to the notes that I create so that's it but overall I would say the ambient technology is really great technology that save a lot of time save a lot of effort it's what I imagine in the future if you are resident rotating or anyone really if this technology exists in inpatient I would imagine that you can just click record during the rounds and then whatever the recommendations is whatever they're gonna do then you can just keep recording until you finish with that particular patient and create notes and it will create notes automatically for you so as a resident you don't have to put so much time to complete your notes again I think that saves a lot of time I think you can focus on delivering care for the patient rather than focusing what you need to write in your notes so that's it the video for today I was wondering if any of you out 
out there have used the ambient AI and what do you think? What is the great thing about it? What's the downside for you? I would really like to hear about your experience, your opinion regarding this technology. I'll see you again in the next video. Bye.